could this be India's deep seek or could be a deep seek wrapper? And in this video, we're trying to figure out the same. This is a new company called 2.ai. This company has released a new model called Sutra R0. So this company says that they have built on the principles of deep seek for multiple languages, including Indian languages. Before we jump into the model in itself, this company was actually founded by Pranav Mystery. I graduated my computer science engineering back in 2000s. And at that time, Pranav Mystery was like quite a rage. Uh, anybody who loved technology, anybody who wanted technology to be like some vision moonshot, always would have seen Pranav Mystery back in like 2000, early 2000s for the presentation that he made about Sixth Sense. And he also headed uh, the Samsung Galaxy Watch, which I enjoyed watching him presenting. I, like it was like a proud moment. So I believe that this company is quite solid given the kind of leadership that they've got, including MIT, ex Samsung and a bunch of other figures. So they've got offices in three places as far as I know. One is in New Delhi, the second one is in Korea, and then the second, third one is in the USA. So it's kind of like India plus Korea research organization put together. So coming to the model in itself, Sutra R0 is supposed to be a thinking model or a reasoning model, but for multiple languages, especially with focus on Indian languages currently. So you can see that this model does extremely well in multiple languages, including Hindi, Gujarati, Tamil and more languages in the massive multilingual MMLU benchmark. So MMLU designed for multiple languages. If you see Sutra R0, so it's a 36 billion parameter is what they mentioned we don't have any other information about the architecture how the model works what is the model built on is it a foundation model is it a model fine-tuned from deep seek we have no clue at all but only thing that we can probably see that this is a model this is a model and it is slightly different from the number of parameters of deep seek r1 so i have no idea what this model is so but if you see sutra r0 it's a model where uh, in MMLU, the multilingual MMLU, this model beats every other model that is available, which means it's 81.4 on uh, Hindi, does a better score than op OpenAI own Mini on Gujarati and bunch of other Indian languages. This model does a pretty good job. And also because this is like an Indian plus Korean collaboration, you can see this model is almost on par, like close to what OpenAI's Korean language and Japanese multilingual MMLU score. So there is not a lot of information about what Sutra R0 is built on, what kind of data set, what is the architecture, is it like fine tuned, this still no information. But the one thing that I found quite interesting is the words that they've put out here. It says what sets a Sutra R0 apart is its logical reasoning layer. So it says layer and the multilingual capability rather than merely responding to inputs, it excels at interpreting complex scenarios, solving multi-step problems and drawing nuanced conclusions across fields. It's very interesting to see this thing because it says, while R1 specializes in natural language reasoning, Sutra R0 employs a structured reasoning for deeper analysis. No idea what does it mean. It also looks like this company is going to focus specially on enterprise clients. Deep Seek's model, this model has a lot of similarity. If you try out this model, you would find a lot of similarity and that is what made me question if this is a deep seek wrapper. So this is available on some platform that they call Ch Chat Sutra, which is very similar to deep seek in itself. So we're going to just do a couple of tests and then see how this model is doing and also do a comparison with the deep seek in itself. First of all, I just went ahead and then asked the question in this model. Vanakam Ningal Yar. This is in Tamil. It's a South Indian language. It's also a language where they said the model does particularly good. If you see here for Tamil, this has scored 77.8 in when you compare it with other models, including DeepSeek in itself. Now, if I went and asked the same question there to this model, it says, okay, the it starts thinking in English. It doesn't think in Tamil. So that means some kind of like translation is happening somewhere in the middle or, or it could be that the model decides to have the internal monologue, the chain of thought in English only uh, while responding back to the user in Tamil. So if you see here, I've said Vanakam Ningal Yar and then it goes into the thinking process and finally says, I want to strike a balance between informative and approach and then finally gives, okay, it says when I come non sutra, that means I'm sutra, Barandala Vilana, it gives a lot of things in Tamil, which is very hard for me to translate it at this point. Okay, it can take Tamil question and it can answer back in Tamil. So the next level is I went ahead and asked, okay, Nadigar Vijay Tandai Peyran. So I'm asking about an actor in Tamil who's, um, I'm asking about what is the name of the actor's father. And I'm giving the actor's name Vijay as a reference. Once again, it goes into the thinking mode. And this is where, you know, the similarity between DeepSeek and this model is extremely close. So for example, I went ahead and asked the same question to DeepSeek. 
what is the name of the act actor Vijay? And here I've asked the question in English and you can see that because I asked the question in English, it goes into a lot of different directions to think about it. Now, when I ask the same question in Tamil, so you can see here, I've asked the same question in Tamil. Nadir Vijay in Tandai Peran. This time, Deep Seek doesn't think a lot. So you can see the thinking time difference. So here it thought for 26 seconds when the same question was asked in English. But for the same question in Tamil, it thought for nine seconds because I think it narrows its whatever the latent search or whatever you would like to call it because it's a Tamil language input text and the actor is a Tamil actor. So I think it kind of makes it easier for it to narrow down. Okay, the user is asking about the name of the actor Vijay's father. Let me recall, I know about Tamil cinema. Now, if you go here, it says, okay, the user is asking about the information. So the thinking process, you can see, it's got a very similar thinking process. And it says, first, I need to recall the name of Vijay's father. Vijay is a prominent actor in Tamil cinema. So I should focus on that particular context. So it goes into similar direction. And finally, if you see here, it has this discussion about is it like the right Vijay, is it the right dad? In this case, the dad's name is Chandrasekhar. So it says S, S.A. Chandrasekhar is a director, producer in Tamil film industry, and he is indeed Vijay's father. Now coming back to Chat Sutra, which is from 2.ai, and then it says it's a straightforward question, and um, it's a good to confirm I have the right name. I believe it's S.A. Chandrasekhar. It seems overall correct, and it is going to respond back. So here again, it says, oh, no, I'm pretty confident it's Chandrasekhar. So it seems, the thought process goes back and forth very similar to deep seek but because they mention it as a 36 billion parameter model i believe that this model must be different from deep seek Nadi here vijay and tandai pair sa chandrasekhar and here you can see vijay and tandai sa chandrasekhar tamil thirayulagil nangariya patta thiraipada thayari parlor and here again it says like um, he is a well known um, uh, you know producer or uh, director in the tamil industry so this is done now moving on to a different language if you see here i went to Hindi and then asked a uh, bank Kaisa Lute. That means how to rob a bank. I just asked this question in Hindi and outright it said it can't uh, assist me with such a request. Maybe there is like an input layer filter. Uh, there is a classifier. But when I asked the same question to DeepSeek and I mean like until this point I never explored DeepSeek's multilingual capability, but it seems super solid. So I went again and asked the same question. It says how to rob a bank. It's illegal and harmful. And then it uh, gives me a lot of information. Uh, my, my Hindi um, uh, translation is not that good. So I'm going to just swap, go here and then paste this. And it's a bank robbery or any kind of crime is illegal. It cannot only ruin your future. Remember any form of crime can ruin your future. So it gives me um, this uh, professional advice that I shouldn't rob a bank. Uh, thanks DeepSeek, I know I shouldn't rob a bank. I've got a lot of things to take care of, but not, <laughs> not by robbing a bank. Okay, so this, during the test, like with this couple of prompts, you can see that uh, it is not entirely like DeepSeek, but I can feel that there is similarity between DeepSeek and this particular model. So either they've got like multiple layers uh, and uh, DeepSeek is like somewhere there in the back end with the distillation model, or um, this could be like just a DeepSeek wrapper. I, I, I don't believe that this is simply a DeepSeek wrapper when they have like put out all these benchmarks and the model name in itself. But if this is not deep seek wrapper, even if it is like a fine tune of deep seeks distilled model, I'm extremely happy to see this model exist. Only gripe is that this model is not open source. This model is going to be, like I said, the company seems to be enterprise focused. And I wish this model will become open source, uh, helping more Indian companies. And in fact, like Korean companies, other languages, they open source this model and we get to use all these uh, reasoning with other languages. But meanwhile, let me know what you feel about this model. You can go access this model in this particular link, chat.2.ai, and then experience it in the language that you understand and let me know what you feel about this model's performance for your own language. See you in another video. Happy prompting.